What's up guys, this is GWR83 here, and today I am proud to announce this new series, American Train Profiles. Have you ever played Train Simulator or play with trains that exist in real life? Well, for this profile, I'm going to take a deep look at these trains. And to kick it off, let's start with the Tennessee Valley Railroad Museum, starting with TVRM number 610. So where exactly did 610 come from? Well, 610 is a coal-burning 280 consolidation built by the Baldwin, Lima, and Hamilton Corporation for the U.S. Army in March 1952. It is one of the last steam locomotives built for, this, for service in the United States and the last new steam locomotive acquired in the U.S. Army. 610 was one of the eight steam locomotives for use on the U.S on the army, on the army railroad, and it was used to, to train soldiers in the railroad operation and maintenance. It was also used to transport on the, on the 31 mile long Fort Issus Military Railroad to interchange with the U.S. Railroad at a junction at, in, in at Lee Hall, Virginia. When the Ford Estes Military Railroad discommended steam operators in 1972, the 610 was obtained by the, by the Wiregrass Heritage Chapter of the National Railroad Historical Society in Donton, Alabama. Six, in Donton, Alabama. But in 1978, 610 was donated to the Tennessee Valley Railroad Museum. And following its 1991 restoration, it served as pulling, pulling power on the TVRM's excursions. It was also featured in country singer Josh Turner's music video for its, for its hit song, The Long Black Train, in 2011. Now what I'm about to show you is the old 610. In this picture, you can see that 610 looks pretty different. The bell is on the, it's on the face. The head lip is way up and the funnel looks very different. And 610 looks very different. And it was done, and it was donated to the Tennessee Valley Railroad Museum in 1971 for its restoration. And it would pull many events and trains, but it wasn't long. I mean, it wasn't even long until 6.30 came along. And the future of 6.10 didn't look too bright. And by, nine, and by 2011, just 10 years later, 6.10 was sadly put out of service. But the story doesn't end here. 610 is going to be, might be restored if it gets inspected right. But for now and on, 610 will only lay there and just, and just wait until inspection. And in 2011, 630 was the only engine running in Tennessee Valley Railroad Museum. All right, you guys, so that was my first American train profile video. If you guys want to see some more of this, please get, click the notification button and subscribe to my channel for more videos. Thanks so much for watching. This is GWR83 signing off.